hi loves welcome back to my channel i'm queen c if you're new here thank you so much for stopping by and if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for stopping by as well thank you all for watching my videos and for staying on here with me and do not forget to like comment and subscribe and also turn on post notifications so that whenever i post a new video you are updated don't forget to leave me a comment if you like what i'm talking about please comment let me know your thoughts and you know if you have any questions also ask in the comment section this is another episode of queen boss tv and queen boss tv is where we talk about business related topics so if you're new here welcome to queen boss tv and i think this should be episode three or four mm. yeah so this should be episode four on this video we're going to be talking about where you can actually get good packaging so obviously as a brand as somebody that wants to own a brand or has a brand or you know whatever you would need packaging everyone needs packaging so packaging differs from person to person because how your packaging is from another person's packaging okay i'm actually making this video because in my last video where i did an inventory haul when i was starting my skincare business i got a comment saying where do you get packaging from i think the person is in nigeria okay so to my own knowledge i can only talk about what i know which is i stay in nigeria so i can only talk about nigeria okay but for my knowledge if you're staying outside the country i know you can get from alibaba and i know you can get from fc yeah so i hope that was helpful as somebody who has a business or who is thinking of starting a business you need to know the type of packaging that would suit your business another thing to notice packaging is money you need to invest in your packaging for your brand so that your brand is unique and your packaging is really what sets aside a business from another person's business so packaging is the real you it's like the icing on the cake because actually the products are what matter but packaging can actually annoy a client trust me i've been there you need your packaging your packaging is what sets your business aside and it really makes your clients happy when they get, get their products in a very nice packaging because i love when clients tell me oh my god i love your packaging it makes me so happy okay so packaging is like the icing on the cake for your brand you need to invest in it so that your brand is you know, unique and people actually love to get items from you the packaging i'm going to be talking about are things that i know and things that i use and i'm going to be talking about where i get them from and i'm not going to be leaving their numbers i'm just going to be leaving their instagram handle so guys just a quick disclaimer every person every brand i'm mentioning on here did not pay me a dime for promotion or ads i'm just going to state everybody i have used and never gave me issues whatsoever when i was working with them and this doesn't mean i'm telling you to use them this is just me telling you what has worked for me and if you choose to use them that's fine but on no circumstances would i be blamed if you know anything happens and you know you get problems with them because i don't know them personally i'm just saying what has worked for me from my own knowledge they are not shady or whatever they've worked perfectly fine for me so i'm just sharing out of my own personal will because when i was starting my business i did not have an information such as this so i just want to help one or two persons out there to actually be able to get amazing packaging materials for their business when i was starting my own business i didn't have this kind of information out there so from what i've been through what i've what i've done so far i know to a, a certain extent um what you should get and where you should get from and obviously if i get more knowledge i'll probably do a part two of this video so for now this is part one okay. so without further ado let's go straight into the video so yeah let's start with one thing that i look for the most okay the thing i look for the most when i was looking for packaging is filler like something to fill up my paper bag and this is um crinkle paper crinkle paper or shredder paper whatever you call it and i look for this so much and i just couldn't find so this is how they look so this is what i use to fill up my paper bag because if you know paper bags when you get paper bags the inner of paper bags are always like filled with hairy stuffs that's like the hairs from when they cut the ribbons that hold the carrier bags okay so i looked for this crinkle paper so much i didn't find it i later found that was like months after my business that i found where to get this crinkle paper in nigeria i know you can get crinkle paper on alibaba and i know you can get on etsy and i know you can get on aliexpress but the thing is those places 
they take a lot of time to ship to you in Nigeria so if I was to run out of this I would have to wait a month or three months before I get this and they are almost the same price with the one I got from Nigeria. I got this Quinko paper from Shredded Paper and Co. So they sell amazing shredded paper. Like I really love their page for that. They sell from big tissue papers like big fillers to small, really small Quinko papers like the one I just showed you. I got this Quinko paper at one eight per pack. So this is like how a pack looks like. It's quite big. It doesn't finish very fast. So I got those for one eight and I got about three. Whenever I finish it, I always restock. So the next thing will be paper bags slash carrier bags. Yeah, that's paper bags. So um, depending on your business, you know, you may be using boxes. I really don't know the best places to get boxes, but I think you can get affordable boxes from Alibaba. The only thing I know with Alibaba is Alibaba is a really nice place to shop. But the thing is, shipping fee is very ridiculous, okay? So, and the best way to actually get things from Alibaba is through an agent of which i don't know if a lot of people have agents but you should get one let me just talk about all the things you can get from alibaba you can get containers bottles labels to your thank you cards to your stickers to everything you can actually get everything on alibaba if you want to do that but if you want to get all these things from nigeria like bottles every time with bottles like bottles containers and the rest there is a store called um, all things purple store i'm not very certain of the instagram name but i'm going to show it on here and you can also go to this market called ojota chemical market or you can also check eco market for containers bottles you know things like that i know they sell at those markets when it comes to paper bags i have been through the worst and the worst and the worst because not like the worst actually but i've i've used three people since i started my business the first person stresses me the hell out even i remember when i did my inventory haul i did not mention the person's name i didn't want to share the person at all because the person was always giving me headache so i did not share the person then i moved to another second person this person was affordable but quality was crap as hell crappy and affordable but very crappy quality so i ditched that one and this person i'm using right now did not give me one single strain of headache when i say headache no headache was involved okay so this person's instagram name is like concepts and they are very the quality is amazing and i feel like they they are the most affordable i have used since i started my business for paper bags i would highly recommend this person very affordable very reliable and his quality is a1 amazing person to shop your paper bags from trust me you can also help you with your stickers because yeah if you want to get stickers like i said you can get from alibaba or you can i think you can also get from aliexpress but i don't know how well that would be but from what me i use i always use go in nigeria because i always want to get my things fast so for example these are some of the stickers that i did yeah so they just come in like this whole this is like a lot of stickers as you're looking at it i got these stickers from sticker lagos i don't have to shout too much like you like i don't have to talk they already know kind of what to do on like the previous person i was using i would recommend sticker lagos for anyone who wants to do stickers thank you cards that's their instagram so when it comes to like protecting your like your packaging what do you use to protect your packaging yeah so i use this screen papers i showed you guys at the beginning and i also use bubble wraps i really don't know where i put my bubble wraps so i would have shown you guys but check out my inventory haul i showed it there so bubble wraps you can get bubble wraps from jota chemical market or eco market or you can also get them from an online store called bubble it ng they have a lot of protective things that you can use to store and protect your packaging so you can check out bubble it they have amazing things so i think that's that about everything so if you want to get nylons paper bag boxes i don't know about boxes in nigeria because i feel like a lot of people that do boxes in nigeria they are they are expensive but i know you can get boxes from alibaba and i wouldn't say aliexpress because i feel like it's not worth it buying from aliexpress but i know you can get from alibaba and you wouldn't like have to like the money you spend will make sense because you're getting a huge quantity 
and they're just going to send you everything directly like at once yeah so if you're looking for nylons if you want to brand your nylons i know like concepts can do it but if you're looking for regular nylons you can check eco market or jetan market just random markets you would get nylons one day one other last thing would be ceiling gun i got my ceiling gun from the market and it's really good for protecting your liquid products so that they don't um spill off just in case of bad delivery you know just very annoying i got this fragile sticker from the market as well but let me tell you something nigerian dispatch delivery companies they don't even pay attention to whatever you put here whether you put fragile or you don't put fragile they will still ship what they want to ship so i really don't use this fragile anymore in case you want i can send it to you <laughs> my ceiling machine so i got it from the market but i know some people sell online but i really don't know anyone because i really didn't check online just went to the market and i copped my let me show you guys so yeah this is the ceiling gun i use it to seal liquid all my liquid products because just, you, you don't want to be having clients that complain stuff poured by mistake and whatnot whatnot and also you need to understand that if you don't have the resources to go all out in your packaging it's fine start as you can when i started my business i didn't have this i didn't have a lot of things i didn't have the people i showed you i didn't have some certain things but i started anyways and as you continue as you go through your business you're going to find your navigation you're going to get money and you're just going to be able to get all these things so don't feel bad if you can't get all these things i'm, I'm talking about in this video but just know that as you keep pushing, as you keep putting your foot forward, you're going to, it's going to get to a time where you can actually afford to get all these things, okay? So guys, I think that's that on this video. I don't want to make it too long because I think it's already long. So thank you so much for watching this video. If it was helpful, please don't forget to comment. I hope I was actually able to help one or two people with this video because I really did want to help someone. But I feel like I was all over the place with this video because <laughs> there are just so many things to talk about and so many places to recommend that i would skip something so in case i skipped anything feel free to comment and just ask me my instagram handle is there my socials are there so just feel free to ask me okay i'm always ready to respond and reply to you guys so thank you so much for watching my video i really love you guys so much thank you for supporting me thank you for watching my videos until next time i'm quincy and i'll be back with another juicy stuff